Hey, what's going on guys? It's Mooney here and today I've got some FIFA 11 Ultimate Team for you guys and as you can see his team's pretty good here and what I'm going to talk about in this video is chemistry and what I'm going to talk about is its importance and how you can get a good chemistry and even a good chemistry with like not even relevant players to each other so is chemistry important? One word, yes. Yes it is. Reasons why. Reasons why because in my experience, I've played with a bad chemistry team, a good chemistry team when I was building my German team up. And for some reason, it seems to flow better. The players seem to move for each other more. They make better runs. I don't know exactly what chemistry actually does, but I think it's something to do with the players working together. They're making runs for each other, and it does work. It does seem to be a lot better when the chemistry is higher. So, how can you get a good chemistry? Well... The first off, the best way to oh, get a jammy goal, and this is what I meant by watching replays. Watching replays, obviously it's not the best goal in the world, but you watch all three replays. But anyway, how to get a good chemistry. The best way to get chemistry is to either have them of the same nationality or the same league. No, not the same league, or of the same team, sorry. The same league will be have a green bar, but it won't be like the very highlighted green bar, whereas with nationality and team it will be the highlighted green bar so with the so for my example my German team I've got Frank Rivery plays by me but he's French so he'll be he, so I have Ozil attacking mid he'll have no connection to him whatsoever but I have Balak he will have some connection to him because he's in the league but if I have Schweinsteiger central attacking mid he'll have a really good connection because he's because he is of the same team as him and so that's how you get good chemistry with like general players getting that the same nationality or the same league or same nationality same league or same uh, team and also get a manager and get the manager for a formation card that'll put your chemistry up by about 20 I believe because I think I was on 86 chemistry and then I got Joachim Lowe and then put the 41212 something like that card to him and that worked and that put my chemistry up but how to get chemistry when the you know, the players aren't exactly related to each other, so say you got Lopez and closer up front, not related in any way, not the same league, not the same team, not the same nationality. So what you do is you buy formation cards of well, what formation that you're playing. Buy the formation card for them, or get the player with the same formation. Just do it in the search for the trade. Then put them as formation and play them on is good for uh, left or right, whatever. And then the chemistry for that person will be up. It won't be full chemistry because obviously they're not connected to each other. But it will get you a better chemistry. I've seen 100% chemistry with the manager with a four what say four one two one two card, and all the players <clears throat> had no no connection to each other. But well, had some like connection because some are obviously they're probably going to be the same league and stuff. But they all had. So we all had good formation, like the highlighted green formation, and we're on the on their good foot, left or right, and that gets you a better good chemistry. So that that's the way you can get chemistry <clears throat> as a as without well the same players, well the same later players, or you just go for like or set yourself out a set team like you say you want the Bayern Munich team, but you want like a better left back, a better centre attacking mid, like I've done. I've come for like the German. Bundesliga team and here I get my goal and he shortly rage quits after it so that's about if video guys I hope you enjoyed that I hope you found these little tips helpful and nice rebound and if you could subscribe to my channel for more FIFA videos comment what you would like and I'll see you guys later